Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. QuickBooks has an easy way to handle bounced checks received from customers as payments against invoices or received as payment within sales receipts. This feature will mark the previously paid invoice or sales receipt as unpaid, remove the funds received from your bank account, allow you to enter any bank service fees assessed by your bank, and also create a new invoice for those fees that you can give to the customer who bounced the check. This is a terrific feature that allows you to easily deal with a situation that often caused many headaches when it occurred. To record a bounced check, open the Receive Payments window by selecting Customers, then Receive Payments from the menu bar. Then find or navigate to the specific payment that you received from the customer that contains the bounced check and display that received payment within this window. With the payment displayed, click the Record Bounced Check button within the main tab in the ribbon at the top of the window. In the Manage Bounced Check window, enter the amount of the bank fee associated with this bounced check into the Bank Fee field. Select the date that the bank fee was assessed by your financial institution from the adjacent Date Field Calendar dropdown, or simply type the date value directly into the field. Use the Expense Account dropdown to select the expense account you use to track bank service fees or bank service charges. If you have class tracking enabled within your company file, you can select a class from the class dropdown to classify the bank fee. Enter the amount to charge the customer for the bounced check into the Customer Fee field. Usually this amount is for more than the bank fee that was incurred for the bounced check. After entering the amount to bill to the customer, click the Next button to continue. On the next screen, titled Bounced Check Summary, you will see a listing of the various actions that QuickBooks will take when you click the Finish button at the bottom of the window. Note the various transactions that will occur, and then click the Finish button to proceed. QuickBooks will then create the various transactions that it listed within this screen to account for the bounced check. You can then re-invoice the customer for the original invoice as well as the new bounced check invoice that QuickBooks creates. The Receive Payments window for the original payment transaction will also be marked as Bounced Check. Just click the Save and Close button to save the transaction and close the Receive Payments window when finished. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.